Okay, I apologize. The last video was so short. We are going to keep going. Okay, so I was in the middle of drawing Hippolyta, the queen from the Amazon, and I was in the middle of drawing What's his name? The Duke Theseus. Okay, and I'm spending way too much time on them. So, we're just gonna hurry up. <sighs> He's gonna have uh, some brown hair too, because why not? Um, it could be nice and curly. Ah! Oh my gosh. falling. Sorry. Okay, shall I give him a little mustache? I think I shall. Or should I give him some nice stubble? <laughs> I don't know what that is. It's not stubble. Okay. Well, he has a little beard, I guess. Okay. So, this is the Duke, um, Duke Theseus, okay, Duke Theseus, how do you spell Theseus? And, um, Hippolyta. Hippolyta, uh, Amazon, warrior, queen, okay, did I finish drawing them, I think I did, alright, cool, oh, so, they are, they're not married yet, okay? But they are in love, so I will draw a little heart. Okay, let's see. So. <clears throat> so Duke Theseus himself was soon to wed. His bride was Hippolyta, warrior queen of the Amazon. Amazons. Amazons, plural? Okay. Anyway. <clears throat> the marriage meant an end to the long battle that the Athenians and the Amazons had been waging. Oh, because just by the way, you guys, this, um, this story takes place in Greece, in ancient Athens. Okay, so it makes sense that um, the Athenians were battling the Amazons. Okay, just a backstory. Theseus had ordered days of feasting, revels and entertainment, all celebrating love. The Duke wanted to help these young lovers. He didn't want Hermia's death upon his hands, but his duty was to uphold the law. Theseus could do nothing for Hermia and Lysander, but suggest another option. I don't know if I'm cut out. So the Duke couldn't do anything about um, them wanting to get married, right? So he's going to suggest something else besides her getting killed, which is very nice. Examine your feelings, fair Hermia, Theseus said. So he's talking to Hermia. Know whether if you yield not to your father's choice, you can endure the life of a nun. So he says, you could either die, right? Like what your father says, you could marry Demetrius, or you could just go off and become a nun and marry nobody. Demetrius, the covenant or death. The choice was Hermia's. The Duke told the young girl she had until his own wedding day to decide. So he's saying, you have until I marry Hippolyta to decide what you're going to do. Then Theseus, Demetrius, and Hermia's father left to tend to some business. Hermia was devastated, so she was very, very sad. Lysander cupped her hands in his. Fear not, my love, the course of true love never did run smooth. 
So he's saying that being in love is never easy. He asked his beloved to meet him the following night in a nearby forest. Lysander proposed they steal away to his aunt's home, which was outside the jurisdiction of Athens. There, they could marry. Hermia threw her arms around Lysander's neck. As the lovers embraced, Helena wandered in, aimlessly twisting a lock of her long golden hair. Godspeed, fair Helena, Hermia greeted her. So let's go back for a second. So Lysander is telling Hermia, he's saying that they will run away to his aunt's home, which is right outside of Athens. So that means that the Duke um, of Athens, Duke Theseus, he doesn't have control outside of Athens. So as long as they're outside that border, they could do whatever they want. Um, so she's very happy about that. So they're gonna run, they're gonna run away. Very exciting. Um, okay, so then Helena wanders in. Helena, who remember is friends with Hermia. Um, and Hermia greets her, so I mean, she says hello by saying, Godspeed, fair Helena, Hermia greeted her. You call me fair, Helena sighed. Oh, teach me how you look and with what art you sway the motion of Demetrius's heart. So she's saying, you're telling me that I look beautiful, but you are so beautiful. Demetrius is so in, in love with you. How do I get Demetrius in love with me? She is, um, she's a little jealous, I think, that... Demetrius loves Hermia because remember Helena loves Demetrius, but Demetrius does not love her back Hermia glanced at Lysander. He nodded um, Take comfort Helena Hermia said gently Demetrius shall no more see my face She and Lysander told her about their plan to elope. So elope means to go get married um, secretly usually without permission which is what's happening, right? So Lysander and Hermia are going to sneak outside of Athens and try to get married secretly. Um, Helena wished her friends well, but after they were gone, the lovesick girl had a foolish idea. I will go tell Demetrius of Hermia's flight. He will pursue her to the wood and I will follow him. If nothing else, I may gain his gratitude. Oh, so awesome. So Helena is thinking now, she has, a, she has a big plan, and she's thinking, if I tell Demetrius that Hermia and Lysander are secretly going to run away and get married, then he'll thank me. He'll, he'll thank Helena, right, for doing that for him, for telling him this big secret. Um, so, okay, we're going to stop there, and we will find out what happens in the next episode. Sorry for all the distractions, you guys, and interruptions. Um, 